Governor Hope Uzodima, represented by the Imo State Deputy Governor Chinyere Komaru, said he recently got free government approval to reopen the Oguta Lake by Coastal Thread Links. He expects that after its dredging, the lake will be one of the structures that will help to re-establish the old regional ties. Uzodima told the media practitioners to use their various organizations to promote national development through constructive dialogue and discourse to term what he calls the essences of the social media. Re-establish the coastal trade route that previously existed from Imo State through Bayelsa and River State. It will always reactivate our cultural ties and strengthen our bond as a people. While I do not advocate for sectionalism among Nigerians, we need to rebuild the economy and political alliance that once made us strong, which encourage a strong relationship among all states of the Southeast and South-South. The president of the Nigerian Guild of Editors, Eza Anaba, had in his opening speech expressed worry that leaders in the South-South and Southeast do not carry editors along in decision-making and issues of development in the region. He called for concerted effort to bring the development issues to the front burner, pointing out that development partners seem to pay less attention to the challenges in the eastern region when compared to their interventions in the north. The stories we tell can shine light on, our, on solutions, foster collaborations across sectors, and empower citizens to take action. Our discussions today will focus on how we can strengthen the media's role in highlighting developmental issues, fostering accountability, and promoting inclusive growth. I encourage each of you to bring your insight, experiences, and creativity to the table as we seek to collectively address the question, question issues. The Vice President Eastern Zone of the Nigerian Guild of Editors, Sedi Ozoene, regretted the near extinction and comatose condition of the state-owned media houses due to underfunding. The issue, he said, must be given serious attention in order to find the way forward. So many of the organizations are either tight or they're just trying to survive. So we are thinking that we should address that issue in a workshop of this nature so that people can be given better tools. Because when governors want to close down your newspaper, for instance, they say you're not productive. They say you're not selling. Why are you with, uh, you have almost uh, 200 staff. How many papers are you producing? Chairman on the occasion, Professor Shinyiro Kuna, underpinned the power of the media in bringing about development. So many other factors have contributed to make development really urgent everywhere. And I'm not afraid to say it, the Southeast in particular is becoming underdeveloped because of marginalization. Sometimes it is our fault, but most times it's a national fault. We need to work harder to bring development again to our region and to the South South. The workshop is being put together by the Nigerian Guild of Editors in collaboration with UNICEF and the Imo State Government, and has as its theme the media as partners in regional development. Ndo Apaleze, Signature TV News.